High stakes child support demands from actor John Cryer's ex-wife. She's asking for nearly $90,000 a month for their 13-year-old son. That's more than 10 times what he usually pays. ABC's Cecilia Vega with the story. He plays the divorced check-writing dad on Two and a Half Men. But this morning, John Cryer's real-life courtroom battle reads like a scene straight out of his hit TV show. Well, I, I figured as long as I was here that I would give you your last and final alimony check. <laughs> To court documents, Cryer's ex-wife, Sarah Trigger, says that since her custody of their 13-year-old son jumped from 4% to 50%, her child support should go up too, from $8,000 to nearly $90,000 a month. The out-of-work actress says she needs the money so the boy can keep up with the rich kids in their Los Angeles neighborhood. So what does the son of a Hollywood star need? Suits, a cell phone, a cello, summer camp. And it doesn't end there. Trigger says in those court documents, she wants her son to have what classmates at his prestigious school have. Birthday parties with trampolines, exotic vacations to Europe and Thailand. Her argument is, oh, when they go to the mother, they're visiting a poor relative. When they're with the father, he's rich. But that's not a valid argument under the law. The couple split in 2004. Cryer did not respond to our request for comment, and Trigger said no comment. Well, neither is speaking publicly about this court fight. Trigger claims in court documents that while her acting career has stalled, Cryer earns $2 million a month. Oh, it's my pleasure. <clears throat> Are you crying? What? No, no, I have, uh, I have allergies. It's probably the dust from opening his wallet. Now, it's up to a judge to decide if two and a half men can keep up with the Joneses. For Good Morning America, Cecilia Vega, ABC News, Los Angeles. Sometimes it's hard to keep up with the Joneses. Ma Cryer now remarried and the couple has an adopted daughter.